Hi, Taras Pluskin here from the Top Shelf Aquatics Farm. Our world's oceans, all of the life within them, from the most massive whale to the tiniest copepod, all these things derive their existence from phytoplankton. Tiny specks of living dust hovering in the water. These things, these tiny factories, phytoplankton, because of the power of their genetics, they are able to take energy from the sun. They're able to take nutrients, nitrates, phosphates. They're able to take tiny trace elements, microscopic billions of gold and copper and silver. They're able to take these things, these inaccessible things, these things that would otherwise build up in excess and become poisonous, and they're able to transform them. With their genetics, they are able to conduct photosynthesis and they are able to form fats, carbohydrates, pigments. All these things that they are the essential building blocks of life. All these things that build copepods, fish, whales, and by extension, even life on land, you and I. All derive ourselves from these things, these phytoplankton, which is why we at Top Shelf Aquatics are incredibly excited to be cultivating, aquaculturing, select strains of microalgae. We are selectively growing these nanofactories uh, for not only use in our own farm systems for growing out corals and other critters that we, we provide to you, but we're producing these things uh, so that we can distribute them right to you, so that you can feed your reef the same living nutrition that a wild reef enjoys every time it receives a new flux of plankton uh, from the wild. Without further ado, I would love to introduce the Reef Genetics line, Top Shelf Aquatics line of aquacultured phytoplankton species, specifically selected and grown by yours truly for their specific beneficial nutritional characteristics. Now, we're gonna have more detailed videos on each and every one of these and perhaps others as we expand the line going on, but for now, I'd like to introduce our three critical actors, the ones that I consider to be the beginnings of a complete nutritional profile when feeding phytoplankton to the reef aquarium. So the first, boom, is Tiaisocrises lutea. This is a golden fat microalgae, specialized and selectively bred to produce polyunsaturated fatty acids. Those things that you normally get through krill oil or fish oil, but this makes it. It synthesizes it and essentially produces these fats which no marine organism, be them a cold pod or a fish larvae or even a coral, can live without. So, they're essential for golden fats. Now, the workhorse of our phytoplankton line of reef genetics, Tetraselmus chui. This is a chlorophyte algae which is basically fairly tough. It can survive in the aquarium the longest, but also uh, it has a good fatty acid profile, better than many other green microalgaes, and even more so, uh, it has methylene cholesterols, which, long story short, are absolutely essential for building hormones and other complex biomolecules that organisms need to make all the various structures and conduct all their various complicated uh, transformations and normal operations of life. And then lastly, we have Rhodomonas. This is a very exciting microalgae for me to be growing because it directly grows pigments. It grows carotenoids, phycoerythrin, and the other essential building blocks of color. But we know that by feeding concentrated amounts of pigments, uh, again, that would otherwise have to be sourced. Uh, otherwise, we can be enhancing the color and nutritional content of all of our reef aquarium inhabitants, from our corals, our fish, down to the tiniest couple pods. So why am I so excited about the Reef Genetics line? Well, one, because all these bottles and all these phytoplankton that we normally use at our farm here are now available directly to you so that you can apply and feed all this concentrated nutrition, this living nutrition directly into your aquarium. But also we provide single strain cultures so that any bottle can be used to scale up a larger home culture for routine feeding, larger scale feeding, or home aquaculture projects. So look forward to talking to you about these various microalgae species in much more detail. Very excited about the Reef Genetics line, and we'll see you next time.